we are a we are a hello aquarius how are you guys doing welcome back to another reading um this is a bonus reading for my aqua family okay happy birthday to my aquarians um my birthday is on the ninth. my birthday is coming nah, nah, nah. if you want to bless your girl i'm not gonna turn that down at all okay <laughs> Uh, but yeah, keep in mind, guys, this is a general reading, so take what you can, leave the rest. Uh, please be sure to like this video, that way other Aquarians can see this video, guys. YouTube will push this video if you like it, okay? Um, if you feel like it doesn't resonate, that's okay. Keep in mind that general readings are timeless, so they can happen at any given point. But you can watch your moon, your rising, and your Venus signs, okay? Um, what else for the Aquarius? What else did I want to say? Oh, uh, I think that's about it, guys. You know this could be completely reversed. You guys know the drill, right? All right, cool. <laughs> what is coming towards Aquarius and a love? Hmm. What is coming towards Aquarius and love? Aquarius, sun, moon, rising, and Venus in love. What is coming towards the Aquarius and love? What is coming towards Aquarius and love? Aquarius. All right, so Aquarius, you got obsession. Obsession, okay? Someone in this connection is gripped by obsessive thoughts. <laughs> I'm guilty. <laughs> us Aquarians, I mean, us air signs, point blank, period, could definitely be in our head just a little bit, okay? Um, there could be some overthinking going on. We did see that from the last reading. Aquarius. Ooh. What is coming towards Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in love. Aquarius. What is coming towards Aquarius in love? Okay. We got addiction. All right, so let's take addiction. Trust is at the bottom of the deck. True love. All right. Hmm, that addiction could definitely be devil energy to where someone's really chained and bound by some kind of thoughts here. <laughs> what is coming to us, Aquarius? And a letter. The Aquarius. For Aquarius. Alright, guys. This is for Aquarius. Overall energy, Aquarius, you got the Seven of Cups. What the freak is going on here? The Empress, the Knight of Cups, Justice. <laughs> Aquarius, we got to have a talk, okay? Are you telling me that someone's treating you like the Empress or someone wants to treat you like the Empress? Even if you're a man, they want to love you, nurture you. They have pure loving intentions, okay? They put you on a pedestal. They're treating you the way you deserve, uh, they're showing you love, right? They want to treat you right and hold you tight, Aquarius. Are you telling me someone has romantic feelings for you, Knight of Cups, but you're in your head about this, Seven of Cups? This can talk about illusions. You know, it's like you're thinking about a lot of things that's not true, okay? You're letting your mind run loose. So, Aquarius, you might be the lunatic. <laughs> if it's not you, keep in mind it could be your person's energy. You want to love them right, treat them right, and they're just... Thinking about your crazy crap that's not true. What is coming towards Aquarius in love? What is coming towards the Aquarian? What is coming towards the Aquarius in love, angels? What is coming towards the Aquarius in love? Justice. What is coming towards Aquarius in love? Aquarius, someone rising in Venus in love. What is coming... Aquarius, someone rising in Venus in love. What is coming? Okay. Oh, let me just pick them from the top of the deck. What is coming towards Aquarius in love, angels? What do we got? Okay. The star. What else for the Aquarian? You may be dealing with the Libra. Libra. <laughs> Libra or um, another Aquarius. What is coming towards Aquarius? The Hermit and the oh, it's coming towards Aquarius in love. Give me one more card at the top of the deck, angels. Temperance, okay. So you could be dealing with there's a lot of people here, guys. <laughs> a lot of signs. So we have Libra, we have Aquarius like yourself, we have Virgo, and we have Sagittarius. Some of you could be dating someone long uh, long distance. 
You may meet this person while you're on your traveling, Aquarius. But you know what, Aquarius? I mean, you got to give this person a chance. I think this person really wants a shot with you here, Aquarius. Could be the little Taurus. We did see um, the Empress, okay? Somebody just wants a chance here. Justice. I mean, someone's in their head. They're weighing the pros and cons of, you know, giving this a chance. I don't know. Someone's kind of being a little analytical about this, okay? But bottom line, yeah, we have Virgo here as well, by the way. Someone's hoping, okay? Someone's hoping for this. They're wishing on a star, Aquarius. <laughs> okay, they want to get close to you. They want to be with you. They feel like you're the right person for them. This is someone who knows what they want. They're serious. So if you're wondering, okay, is this person here to play with me? They're not here to play with you. They're the king of swords. Meaning that they're decisive. They have integrity, morals. They know what they want. They wouldn't say something that they didn't mean is what I'm hearing right now. So what's the problem here? Hermit bowl, are you guys not talking right now? For some of you or someone's just kind of really thinking about this opportunity. Some of you, I'm hearing that someone needs to get a divorce and maybe you're waiting for this person to get divorced or this person's waiting on you to get divorced. In that case, it will be happening because the King of Swords and the Justice card is here. But you're going to have to be a little bit more patient if that is your situation. But I feel maybe this person has kids or you do, but this person just wants to make you happy, Aquarius. That I mean, that's all they want. <laughs> that's literally all they want, Aquarius. The sun is here. They have strong feelings for you. You know, the Ace of Cups is right behind that. I mean, quite frankly, you know, they care about you here. For some of you, if this is a third party situation, like I said, uh, they're hoping that you would probably wait for them and that you would be there for them when, they, when they're done with their crap. I mean, I don't know about you, but I'm not dealing with none of that. You got me for that. <laughs> Wait on yourself. I'm not waiting on you. All right, what is the justice card? Some of you may be waiting on justice from someone who's in a third, who has you in a third party situation. Meanwhile, you could have new love around you, Aquarius. So someone's afraid to take a leap of faith here. Someone is afraid of change. They have a fear here. The fool is in the reverse. Why are you not taking this leap, Aquarius? Oh, child. All right, what is the three of wands for Aquarius? Do you feel like this person is too good to be true? What is the three of wands for Aquarius? In love. Six of wow. So you have a hard time letting this person go, Aquarius. So I'm going to tell you this right now. If you're waiting on someone who's involved, you need to cut the crap here. You need to cut the crap. Okay? I feel like someone's still holding on and waiting on an ex or someone to come back. Even if they have someone new in their life. Now, if that's you, Aquarius. Okay? This, I'm talking to you. It's time for you to heal and move on. Because who knows if this person is really going to take that leap. I mean, they want to, but will they? You got two threes here. This could definitely be third party. They they want you to wait. What is the King of Swords for Aquarius? Some of you are hoping or waiting on somebody, you know, from the past. Who, uh. You're hoping for more with you don't want to just be friends or friends with benefits you want more with this person but they i mean they may not they may not be on the same uh, page with you aquarius you got the hermit reverse justice the emperor reverse so Aquarius, this person may be ghosting you coming in and out they're gonna come and they're gonna kind of explain themselves and tell you what their plan is about leaving this person or whatever they may even tell you that they love you emperor emperor is in the reverse so this may definitely be somebody who uh, maybe it's the father of your child, mother of your child. Maybe they need to leave someone like that. Someone may be in a controlling relationship. Hmm. What is the star for the Aquarius? What is the star for the Aquarius? The six of wands, the five of cups reverse. And so you're worried, you're going crazy. You're hoping that you can have this person, you can be with this person, Aquarius. <sighs> this person's not single. This other person that you're hoping for, I hate to say it, they're not. What is the hermit for Aquarius? And love? Yeah, but I do see new love around you. I do see that. 
could be with a Virgo. Ace of Cups is in the reverse. So some of you don't want to open your heart up to new love. Why not? What is a temperance card? Oh, this person's not single, Aquarius. I think, I, I don't know why I'm getting that you're just kind of waiting on someone who's single. I mean, who's in a relationship or something like that. Or if you're the one in a relationship, this person's waiting on you. You still have hope to be with this person. But like I said, Aquarius, I wouldn't, I would strongly not recommend you waiting on this, on this punk, okay? <laughs> on this jerk. Because this person may be wanting to really just have their cake and to eat it too. I don't give a damn what you think they are. Twin flame, whatever. There's something that you're not seeing. There's something that you're not seeing if you are in a third party situation. Two of, two of wands, I mean, you deserve better here. You, I mean, you don't deserve to be second best or someone's rebound or whatever this is, Aquarius, okay? Um, Queen of coins, this is what I'm trying to say. This is what I'm trying to say. Um, it's safe to trust in this in, uh, situation. This love is, okay. There may be children involved. This friendship is leading to more. Some of you may want to be friends. Or you want to be, you would want more um, with this person. If this is your friend. But unfortunately, I just kind of see you just kind of waiting in vain. Or this person kind of waiting in vain. It's a third party situation. This person may have not even been able to let go of their ex. They could still be holding on to their ex, Aquarius. Is kind of what I'm picking up. So you have a choice, two of wands. You have a choice to move on with, like I said, brand new love here. It's being presented to you. Hmm. This is interesting. All right, well. What does this person want to say to Aquarius? Some of you that are in relationships, I hate to say it, but I mean, your partner may be kind of uh, thinking about getting a divorce or something like that. Maybe you both need to kind of just end it already with each other. They say that you deserve better than them. I'm sorry for ghosting you. I don't know. For them to say some crap like that, they must really be fucked up. This person really did get you involved in the third party. For a lot of you. All right. And there, I mean, yeah, you a sorry motherfucker, all right. <laughs> and major regret. Wow. They're craving you. Got me drinking a lot. <laughs> wow. It's very interesting. Rebound lover. See, you may have been this person's rebound, Aquarius. I hate to say it. You may have been this person's rebound. they may still be holding on to their ex there it is. then you have someone new who's here to stay i'm gonna fight for you i wish i could take it all back Aquarius. they don't satisfy me like you do so <sighs> i don't know Aquarius. if i were you i wouldn't get involved in this person's crap that's all i could really say right now i really wouldn't get involved in this person's crap because they really have you in a love triangle Whoever the hell this person is. And I think this person is full of crap. Page of Cups is in the reverse. Hmm. The love may even be unrequited. And this person is just kind of using you as like a rebound or something to help get over their ex or some crap like that. So be very careful. We don't want the freak doing this to us. Okay? Don't let the freak do this to you, Aquarius. For those of you, if it's not third party, like I said, I mean, you definitely got somebody who's uh, who could give you what you want here. I mean, this person is the one. You need to give this person a fair chance. I know you. I mean, we're fixed signs. It's hard for us sometimes to let go of the one or, or the one that we really love. It's hard for us to accept change sometimes, but I mean. You deserve better than this. All right. Well, what else do 
can tell me about the situation for Aquarius in love? What's coming towards Aquarius in love? What else? Aquarius. So this is what I'm trying to say, Aquarius. You really got the one around you. You got the one around you. Because we know with a Gemini or a Virgo very strongly. We have Taurus here, Six of Wands. Yeah, this person right here is your true love, Aquarius. I don't know what the freak you think you're doing. But it's time to get over whoever this past freak is. The past freak is still going to be watching you. But truth be told, I mean, all they could do is continue breaking your heart with a third party. You got a new love offer coming in here. So it's up to you what you want to do. Because this past person, if they want to leave their person, they're probably going to tell you. And they're going to expect you to kind of wait on them or whatever. But this new person is looking like they want commitment with you. You know, they want to marry you. They're serious about you. They really want this, Aquarius. And I see this being a very su successful union if you give this other person a chance. But this other person is going to continue to, like, break your heart. Their third-party crap. Aquarius. What else? See, that's what I'm trying to say. Longing. You're pinning for someone who's not available right now. You or your partner may be, be too dependent. This person may even be codependent on someone else. Aquarius. Yeah, I think you're you're longing for someone who's just married or they're in a relationship or they live with someone or whatever their deal is, okay? They're just not ready. Secrets. There are hidden feelings or undisclosed intentions. See, this romance, I feel like it's about you and the new person. This romance. All right, Aquarius. Well, the cards have spoken. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this reading. Um, let me do a quick charm pull, by the way. Who is Aquarius dealing with? They may be in a karmic relationship or something, but that's none of your business, Aquarius. It's none of your business. Life is short. To be waiting around for someone who's involved. Are you serious? Oh, hell no. All right. Cancer, Capricorn, Scorpio, and Gemini. Okay. Moon rising or Venus. Uh, oh, got the hams assigned. There's a lot of L's here. P A V Q U C A N E M T Z N V. Nice. What you wanna do, Aquarius? You got a choice to make. All right, love you. See you guys next time.